So if I gotta choose someone, then it must be her. She been here since day one. I guess. What's going on, everybody? It's me, Leo Lopez, back at again with this video shit. I know it's been a while, but I'm back. So I know it's been probably a few months since I last posted. I want to say it's probably back in July. So July, August, September, October, November, December, January, February, March, April, May. About too many months. Ten, nine, ten months. I've been I've been really busy. Uh, there's my life has been like you know a roller coaster, like the whole body popping type of stuff. It's just been like one day is good, and the other day is like pow. But. At least I'm back. I thought I'd upload a video, a quick one. Kind of keep you guys updated on where I'm at. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I've lost a few subscribers. And for those of you who have stuck with me, thank you very much. I appreciate the support. You guys are the best. A lot of you, you'll see me on a daily basis and you'll ask me questions like, hey, how's it going? What's new? And all this fancy stuff. So, just a little update, I guess. Went into school, fall and spring did a few classes it's getting harder I'm still debating between civil and mechanical engineering right now I'm leaning more towards civil engineering uh, and honestly like to me a lot of people say that the last few years of college actually get easier for me they're actually getting harder but I think it's the way my brain functions can't really focus so I'm gonna give myself a little bit of a break I know some of you are probably gonna be like oh no you're not gonna be going back to school trust me I want to go back to school I just mentally know that I'm not there yet I need a break and my goal is to graduate from school and one day I'm going to do it all right uh, a few changes I've been getting a lot more facial hair so I'll let you guys check all right I don't know if you guys can tell there's a little bit more than I had before this actually will grow a little bit more uh, with time I actually ended up shaving it it's it's coming in better uh, you can still see that there's some places in my face where my hair is just like I don't want to come out uh, but it's okay I mean I think it still looks good especially from a distance I've had a lot of people compliment it tell me that uh, it looks pretty good and all that other thing is the voice as you can tell has gotten deeper but I, I honestly think that this is probably gonna be the deepest it's gonna go I don't think it's gonna go any deeper than this I've noticed uh, shoulders they're getting you know they're getting wider I've been able, my energy still staying up. Uh, at night, I'll do push-ups and then I'll get tired. I'm like, all right. And next thing you know, boom, I got more energy doing it again. Other day, I actually ran my three mile to see where I was at. And I'm actually, for not running in a certain amount of time, but long distance, because I'm still doing soccer. I'm actually at the same time rate that I was when I was in the military, which is like 21 minutes plus for three miles. Which in my opinion, I think that's actually pretty good because I haven't really been running, I'm not gonna lie. I probably ran a few times in the past year, but not continuously like like I used to. Uh, I did notice weight loss. I have my little belly, but I have noticed I've thinned out just a little bit, uh, especially from here and down, like that fat that I've lost. Mentally, it's, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I've been on testosterone since October of 2017. Here and over a year and a half you plan on being on testosterone I will tell you that it's it mentally there's a reason why there's some insurance places that make you do counseling because they want to make sure that you're be prepared for it um, I'm bipolar I have anger issues it has affected that and I'll be honest I've had some problems and I'd never wanted to accept the fact of being on medication and finally I decided to follow through and just be on medication. I do feel that testosterone has made it worse. I mean you gotta remember it's hormones running through your body. You can't just put a whole bunch of crazy stuff in a car make it go fast and not expect to have other things you need to do to it so it doesn't blow up on you and that's basically how your body is you have to make sure you take care of it every way possible um, and I'm not a doctor so do not take this as if I were a doctor or any certified person this I'm just talking out of experience talk to your counselor uh, if you have anything else going on in your life it, it just helps you know next thing is I will begin to play on a all men's league here in Idaho Falls on Sundays that's pretty exciting 
Um, it's gonna be something new for me. Well, kind of not different. When I was actually in the military, it was one year, I think two females on a soccer team and it was all men's and I'm not gonna lie, I don't hate, I'm not hating on Idaho Falls or anything like that, but California's soccer skill level is like compared to Idaho Falls and it was intense. And the guys don't care. They do not care at all. If you're a female or a male, they will be so aggressive to you and they will make you learn. But they'll also be supportive and they'll teach you new techniques and all that. I have a court date coming up June 26th. If everything goes as planned and everything gets approved, my name will officially be changed from Cynthia Andrea Lopez to Lionel Andres Lopez Garcia. A lot of people have asked me why I added the Garcia. Technically, I didn't add the Garcia. My grandma baptized me in Mexico on all my paperwork. She added Garcia to it. A lot of people don't believe me, but it's it's the truth. Here in the US, they didn't add it to my paperwork. For those of you that don't know, my grandma is my mom. That's who I was raised by. She took me in. Keeping the Garcia part in my name is like keeping something from her because she means so much to me. Uh, so that's, a lot of people have asked me and I just hope that it helps answer that question why I'm adding Garcia. I'm not just adding it just because I want to be a Garcia. No, I am a Garcia because she gave me that last name when she took me in and she baptized me, which is my- All right. So that you can see one. And Garcia on that one as well. Just want to make sure no one thinks that I'm lying, but yeah. Then uh, that, I will be hopefully starting a new job here soon. I need to start focusing more on getting a job that has to do a little bit more with the career that I'm AutoZone and the state office building is gonna be going out the door. Uh, other than that, I mean, I, I just wanted to make this a short video. I don't have much more to say. You see the differences, you hear the differences. I'm a lot more calm. Anger issues have, it's narrowed down a lot more. I will be uploading a new video. I'm gonna be doing the Buffalo Wild Wings like tasting challenge, I, would, I guess. Basically, I'm gonna buy all the levels and just try them out and tell you guys what I think about them. I am looking for two people to join me for that. So if you are down, just go ahead. Uh, DM me, message me, hit me up, let me know that you're interested, and then we'll get that video going. Don't forget to like this, subscribe, share, comment, hit me up, let me know what's new, and I'll see you guys next time. What you thinking? I promise I'll listen. Pero dime lo que piensas. No tenga vergüenzas. Porque yo no voy a hacer nada que te diga. I'll give you the reason